everybody welcome back to another video today i have another disney video for y'all this time it is going to be the disney college program tag now i saw two dcp tags one was geared for people who have already done the program which i have and the other one is geared for people who are about to do the program which is also me because it's kind of toward the beginning of like i'm about to go down in two weeks I've decided that I'm going to do the latter of the two and I'm going to do the one that is like geared for now. Otherwise we'd be talking about my program from 2013 and that's a whole nother situation. Um, so this one is a little bit different than the Disney tag, which is just kind of basic Disney stuff. I do have a video from that that was posted five years ago now. Uh, if you want to watch that, it's super cringy. I'm super awkward but that is still like a public thing. You can watch it if you want to, but I warn you that it is very cringy. Anyway, all right, so there are 10 questions and I'm gonna try not to blabber on too long, try to make this pretty quick and easy. Question number one, how did I hear about the program? Um, I actually first heard about it from, this was a long time ago now. This was like my first time in college. Um, there was a girl in another sorority that I was really close to and she did it and told me that I would absolutely love it and like told me all about it and whatnot. So that's how I first heard about it. And ever since she did it, I knew that it was something that I had to do. How was my interview process? For this program, it was actually very painful because I was a restricted rehire from self-terming on my second program back in 2014. So I was terrified and like super nervous that I wasn't going to get accepted because I had heard from so many people that restricted rehires, it's very hard to get re like accepted back into the Disney college program, which it is very hard. Like it's actually pretty rare for restricted rehires to get rehired. It is possible, obviously, like I've done it. I've seen other people that have been accepted. Um, I think for me it was really beneficial that I had already done the program once before and like to, to completion I had already completed a program before and they knew my circumstances of why I had to self-term and then I had the same job for almost four years between self-terming and then reapplying so there wasn't like I'm not a they knew that I wasn't a flaky person um, but the waiting game was very hard because in the past, like the other two times that I had applied, I went through the whole process so fast that I didn't really have to wait very often or very long. Where was I when I found out? Um, Keith and I had actually just gone to Universal for spring break. We did a long weekend in Universal and we were driving back. We were on the way back on a Monday, Tuesday, I can't remember, Tuesday, on a Tuesday. We were driving back and I just happened to like check my emails and I saw the congratulations and I started crying. I was just like, oh my God, Keith, like I got accepted. Because I, mean, I didn't think that I was going to. I was telling myself that I wasn't going to get accepted because I was a restricted rehire. It was amazing. And because I had actually like driven past, we had driven past casting at some point in time that weekend while we were drive down there and I was just kind of like in my head, I was like, casting, like, please, please let me come back. And then three days later, I got accepted. Uh, what is my role? I am attractions. How did I find my roommates and how many do I want? I found all of my roommates through the Facebook groups and there are six of us total. So it's myself and five other girls. What am I going to miss most while in the Disney college program? This guy right here. Keith actually kind of makes fun of me a little bit and always says, he's like, you're gonna miss Zeus more than you miss me. I'm like, well, yeah, because I get to talk to you and like FaceTime you. I can't talk to Zeus or FaceTime Zeus. Also, Keith is gonna come down and visit me. Zeus can't, well, that's actually, Zeus can come down and visit me and I'm trying to get Keith to bring Zeus, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Oh, it can't happen because Keith is flying now. What is my favorite Disney park? I'm gonna have to go with Magic Kingdom but it's definitely, it's really close between Magic Kingdom and Animal Kingdom. What is the first thing I want to do when I get down there? Oh, that is a loaded question. I would say go to the parks, but we don't get like our passes to go to the parks right away, or at least not that I remember, it might be different now. Last time we didn't get our passes right away, we had to wait a few days. 
So, or tell tra um, traditions. What is number one on my bucket list? The water parks. I have yet to go to one of the water parks. I also haven't really ridden any of the rides at Epcot. There's so much that I didn't do in my past programs that I want to do, so it's really hard to pick a bucket, like a number one bucket list thing, but I probably have to say the water park. And then last one, what is one thing you want to take away from the program? I really want to network on this one. Like, I've already done the programs before. I'm sorry, I just, I see how messed up my hair is in the screen for viewfinder. I'm just like, woof. I see these little frizzies and it's driving me crazy. I really want to talk to people and get an idea of how I can eventually get the professional internship in either technology or communications um, slash public relations. So yeah, what I would love to take away is apart from like more amazing memories and lifelong friends and all of that jazz that I already know is going to come with the program from this one specifically having already done it before and having like a goal in mind in terms of working for Disney in the future. I definitely wanted to just take away like a lot more knowledge in terms of professional internships and what it's like to work on the corporate side of Disney because the only thing that I'm familiar with is working in the parks. I think I'm gonna have to go with that and that's it. That was only 10 questions. I'd call this video a success much more successful than my 30 questions in five minutes. All right, Bob, we're gonna say goodbye. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, work hard, be kind, spread good vibes. I love you all. Goodbye.